welcome to Batuu. My name's Marge. I'm a Hilk Empath, and I just like having these little talks and the way I feel about things. Today, I feel pretty good. I slept good. Mom slept good. The birds are singing outside the window. In the last 10 minutes, there had been freaking two sirens go by, so <sighs> things aren't good for everyone, but maybe they'll get better. Anyway, uh, let's see. I don't really know what's going on with the astrological charts right now. I know yesterday was love day, Valentine's Day, and I got me and mom a cupcake, and we had it in, in, in the evening, and, 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 and uh, you know, she's just, every day when I ask her, mom, did you have a good day? And she's like, yeah, it was a good day. It was a pleasant day. It was a nice day. Then we call that a win, so, anyway. I gotta make, that's my job, is to take care of her right now, so until that changes, I gotta do the best job I can, and, uh, she's kind of a neat lady, we spent about 10 minutes putting her socks on this morning, <laughs> cause I put them in the dryer to get them toasty warm for a while, and then I freaking put them on, and I gotta get them just right, she had club feet, she was born with club feet, and I think about how, man, what a disadvantage in her life that was, just because of reflexology purposes, you know? Cause, and she had to have all these tendon anyway I don't want to get too far off base she had a good she enjoyed the cupcakes I enjoyed the cupcakes I'm going to make her some waffles here in a little bit put a little cinnamon on them and drizzle a little maple syrup on it just not too much just enough for flavor she, you know that's what I try to do because she doesn't it, when it's cold she doesn't like to leave the house much so I, I, I spice up her life with variety and food so and I, the idea of sameness makes my third eye twitch, so I like to switch it up a lot, too. Plus, diet is important, and a balanced diet is even more important, so. Anyway, um, but it's also important is, is how the food makes you feel, you know. That's why I believe, that's how I see it, is when people get sick and they eat chicken noodle soup, it's, uh, maybe there's nutrients in the chicken noodle soup, maybe it's not, but it's the care that somebody took. The time that somebody took to prepare something to, to provide nutrients for you is the love that was put into it that, you know, that's why people when they, because that, that's what when they eat soup, they remember that all encompassing, not just the soup, you know, it's food, love makes food and love makes gardening and love makes plant, you know, love makes everything better yesterday was you know recognizes that i love every day i love love you know i can't wait to be in love that's the true test of yourself you want to know about your true character defects fall in love <laughs> come bursting out your insecurities fall in love you know you want to practice all your true spiritual abilities fall in love so one day i hope i get the opportunity you know I thought I've been in before, but I don't see how I could have been because I never spoke my truth, and, you know, and they didn't stick around anyway. <laughs> I'm a lot, <laughs> but I'm worth it. I'm definitely worth it because I've been thinking about love and how wonderful I'd treat my special lovely, <laughs> my precious, my my BFF, my life partner, my whatever, you know, yin to me yang, whatever. But I see he hope, you know, and it, I like, and that's the thing is there's parts of me that are broke that I know that love, only love will heal. I understand that. And that, it, it's an ego blow to me to recognize that. The cat just came busting in. Why you come busting in and make background noise, Stan Lee? Is that because I'm mad about it? He's doing this thing. I changed the dog. The dog went back. The dogs went back to their old food that they used to like. And so... Don't let Tucker eat you. Tucker will eat you. See you chase you. He's a chasey guy in here, son. The chasey guy's in here. Don't play with this chasey guy. He did will tease you. He will get you. The chasey guy will get you. That's the chasey one. Over there, that's Tucker the chasey one. Stanley's all fist bitchety. What was I saying? Stanley, you make me ruin my whole train of thought. Yeah. It was a good one, too. Confounded divine in my lack of focus. <laughs> Food. Oop. I didn't mean to do that. We're talking about food. Oh, Adele just popped up. I'll just start over. I'll just get on to a different tangent. I wonder how she, she's lost 100 pounds. 
since her spiritual awakening, since her ascension. That's the way I see it, man. When people start feeling, oh, I was talking about love and how I've been waiting for, or how I've been freaking imagining 45 years how to treat, treat my, the person that I care about most. But first I had to learn to love me because that's the part that was the deficit. I didn't love me because how would I? I never saw examples of how it was done because my parents had their own stuff, you know? And so, and so I saw examples of how they behaved. And so I was drawn to them and I had a brother and, and, and I saw examples of how, so I looked, use them as examples. A lot of times I use them as examples of what I don't want to do. <laughs> that is not for me. You know, most of my life I've, you know, I've never been in line with, the mainstream, the patriot, you know, my, I was an orphan with parents, more or less, and I'm not even exaggerating sometimes, at sometimes, um, I'm just got, I'm lucky I didn't freaking fall into the system and freaking end up in, 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 in the system because I could have just been, I just would have slipped through the cracks a long time ago, you know, but I did manage to get a college degree and, de de and, Enlisted the Air Force, ran some wards in spite of my deficits. So, I mean, you win some, you went lose some. But yesterday was my 900th video, too. Gosh, he's being honorary. He's getting into stuff. He's knocking stuff down. Now he wants out. He wanted in. Now he wants out. He can wait a couple more minutes. So, I think, um, I don't know, a lot more people are coming into their freaking quiet time more people their lives have changed i know my life has changed drastically in three years the last three years like other people you see it you see it everywhere you know you hear stories you, you hear stories about things that are going on in people's lives and big huge things are happening these are tower moments huge moments these are events you know that happen in people's lives every day you know maybe there's gonna be a blast from the freaking space maybe we'll see beetle juice freaking light up do the supernova nova and that'll be who knows you know there's there's a possibility for every reality there is an earth and a universe that exists for every thought in reality so the more that people think the same thoughts in realities they're creating this world. So be really mindful of where you're pointing your thoughts. Don't think about freaking poles flipping. <laughs> and freaking, you know, I live in Salem, Morgan. I really don't want to see a freaking four mile wall of water coming at me. You know, I, cause I believe my ancestry and my, my DNA already is past post-traumatic stress from Atlantis, you know, so... I don't need that kind of freaking, I don't need to go out that way again, you know, I don't think that's my, per I think since I did it that one time, okay, I'm good in the traumatic freaking life, life all, you know, the freaking life ending by walls of water and things like that, so keep focusing on how you want the world to be and the world will turn into that in a positive way. Is things it can win for negative too, but we got to keep it positive, folks. Got to keep it positive. Dream big, dream huge, love big, love bold. But you got there's boundaries, you know. Some people don't want your love, you know. Some people don't want your attention. I know that because I freaking people haven't wanted my affection, non sexual or otherwise, you know. Because my affection, most I like one per there's one person in this world for me, I just don't know who she is yet. And I knew, who, I just know who she's not. <laughs> so, you know, and I know I'll see her when I reach that, meet that vibe. I know, I know it'll feel, it'll, it'll feel like me, but it'll look different kind of thing. But anyway, same flame, like attracts like. Um, but I'm excited for the changes in me to see, because, I mean, I think I'm a pretty decent person anyway, but I just like to see, you know, me plus plus, you know, positive, you know, support and just, I've never had someone really love me unconditionally. So I just, I, but I imagine what it's like, you know, and I don't think I sell myself short in that area, but anyway, what else is going on? Ah, freaking, 
more nonsense, you know. I was a, I was thinking about going downtown and visiting <laughs> some kids and seeing what their stories were like, you know, and how they got there. Because they keep having all these, they keep renting all of these conference rooms and all of these 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 um, banquet rooms and feeding themselves these meals that cost all this money to talk about homelessness instead of use, sitting in an office where they work, pay themselves a, a reasonable amount, not $140,000 a year and all these things, and use that excess money from their wages that they don't need and freaking renovate these buildings downtown, put people in there, then no, everybody has a roof, put cots in there, you know, it's not, stop talking about it, these people are freaking resource hoss talking about stuff, and this is all the stuff that's pissing me off that needs to change, because this shit can change in an instant, and people are dragging their feet, but hey, you know, you spend your billions on sports and male enhancement drugs and all kinds of other bullshit stuff that other, you know, a selected few, but uh, that stuff's all it changing anyway. I'm getting off the love subject, and I don't want to do that. Um, so I hope people aren't have, feeling too hungover this morning. You know that happens after it's the dip. I talk about it when there's a good sensation and people feel really good. You always got to mind the dip. It's just like in the heartbeat. It goes up. And then it goes, when it comes back down, it goes below the baseline. Then it comes back up to the baseline. So mind the dip, folks. Uh, that's about all I got for now. Hope you have a rad day. Peace!